What's going on, Hit Squad? This your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for family heirlooms, all Azuri, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Sunday, August 1st, and as I say each and every video, Smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the channel, just checking out the cycles, just checking out me in general. Make sure you guys subscribe and hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. If you guys want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter at HitmanMiyagiYT. How to spell that is right there in the bottom left hand of your bottom left hand corner of your screen. Is down below the video in the hashtag, and it's down in the description box below as well. Um, first things first, let's get to Madame Nazar's location, which today she's in my favorite spot. As we know, if you your a true subscriber you know this is one of my favorite spots uh she's right here right outside of emerald station right around the way from the fence she's right here and she will be here until 2 a.m that's eastern standard time new york time zone east coast time zone for those of you who don't know or not of america how i personally get to her when she's in this location is i'll simply fast travel to emerald station if I'm not in the area, I'll simply fast travel to Emerald Station and run down right here because she's right around the way from the fence. Once you get to the fence, if you know how to get to the fence, you know how to get to her. Go to the fence, and but do not stop. Just keep on following that road down and around to her location. She's like a couple feet away. Uh, I usually just run down from my moonshine shack in there because yeah. that's me. Uh, the next thing I want to get to is the Caribbean Rum Antique Alcohol Bottle, which today is up in Coulter. It's up here in Coulter uh, area. When you do fast travel, you should it should put you around like around here somewhere, maybe or around in the city somewhere. Go to this house right here, or I don't I don't think it's a shack, but I think it's a house. Go to this house right here, and I think directly to your left is where the antique alcohol bottle is right in the cabinet next to the door uh, that's that i don't really see a lot like there are a bunch of fossils around here like with every cycle like it's some like over in this area down here and then i think i saw one up here somewhere like up in this area but that's with every cycle so if you guys do want to see that in the description box below i do have a link so you guys can find out, you know, where the fossils are for this cycle. Uh, let's get to here or where we normally do business, which is the Le Lemoyne area of the map. Trying to get everything in focus or, you know, in frame so you guys can see it. If you guys can see it. The cycles for today, Sunday, August 1st, are... Family Heirloom Cycle 6, All Lost Jury Cycle 1, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 1, Wildflower Cycle 5, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Tarot Card Cycle 2, and or Bird Egg Cycle 6, and Fossil Cycle 4. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The Cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of Fossils, and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Uh, let's get to these things that we will find across the Lemoyne area of the map. I don't know if I have any extras for you guys today, but I know I at least have these couple that I did mark. Uh, let's see. I do I do have a couple extras or that I want to tell you guys about. Starting up here, there's a fossil right here at this location. Come over here with your metal detector, and that's what you will get. Uh, over here by this house, there's a outhouse. There's an outhouse right outside, and right inside that outhouse, you guys get a page of cups tear card. Uh, right here next to this dot here, you guys will get a coin, a random coin. Come over here with your metal detector, 
and that's what you will get. There's also a tarot card here right next to the L and Legras. Right here on this dock, there's a Six of Swords. Right on one of the posts of that dock, there's also a tarot card inside this shack here. Right inside that shack, you guys will get a Four of Wands. Let's go over to the left, I mean to the right a little bit. Right here inside this first marker, yes, first marker. Right inside this first marker, you guys, there's a miniature church right there, right next to the Y and the K. So you guys know. Right inside this miniature church, you guys will get a Ainsworth cross necklace. Go inside. You have to make your character crouch down to walk inside. Go inside and grab it off the back um, shelf or whatever, and that's how you get that. Go down a little bit to this next marker next to the N and NWA. Right here at this location, you guys will get a bird egg. This bird egg. This bird egg is a egret egg, E-G-R-E-T. It's in a tree. Shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Let's bounce all the way over here to our next marker, which is a antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is a scotch whiskey bottle inside this house here. Go inside the house and it's on the table to the right as soon as you walk in. Over here at our next marker, which is on the coastline of the Kamasa River, right here at this location, pull out your metal detector and you guys will get another random fossil. I cannot tell you guys what fossil you will get because it is randomized. Let's bounce all the way back over here, closer to this house right here. There's a barrel over here in this area. And on that barrel, it's about right here, I think. I'm not 100% sure, but it's right over here in this area, in this little corner here. Uh, there's an Eight of Pentacles on top of a barrel right here at this location. Let's go down a little bit to our next marker, which is a family heirloom. This family heirloom is on a bench right near the back porch area of this mansion. That, did I say it was an ebony hairbrush? It is an ebony hairbrush, and that is a family heirloom once again. Let's go over to the cemetery where our next card is, or where our next item is, our next marker. And as I said, this is a card. This is a tarot card. This card is a Knight of Wands. So come over here right where the marker is, and you guys will get that tarot card. Let's go down a little bit to our next marker. If you guys do come across this way, you got to come about here and go down a little alleyway. When you get here, go up the, the ladder here, go across the pathway here, uh, then jump across the railing, follow that pathway here. There's another railing, jump across that railing, follow the pathway down into this antique alcohol bottle, which is a Irish whiskey bottle. If you guys did not get it from that whole little scenario, it, it is on the second level of this complex or building or whatever so you have to make your way up top to get this bottle how you do it is get on that ladder and make your way around to the antique alcohol bottle which once again it is a irish whiskey bottle i have a couple extras for you guys like by gus there's a boxwood comb right across the way and a very large treasure chest across the way next i mean on the other side of the fountain right here so open up that treasure chest and you guys, guys will get a boxwood comb, which is a family heirloom. There's another family heirloom right about here down this alley. There's a bench. Right on that bench, you guys will get a tortoise shell comb right down this alley on the ground floor. So make sure you go grab those things. Let's go over here to our next marker, which is by this takeover series. Come over here with your metal detector and you guys will get another family heirloom, which is a carved wooden hairpin. It's in a pile of trash, so don't be scared to go over in the trash. Let's go down to our, or let's go over before we go down. Let's go over to this next marker, which is a coin. This coin is randomized. I cannot tell you guys what coin you will get because it is randomized. Come over here near this little, there's a broken down cart in this field. 
come over here near that broken down car with your metal detector and you guys will get a random coin there's also a card over here on the balcony I don't, it's not a balcony it's a bench of the stairway uh this is a king of cups if you do look over here from here at this marker you should be able to see it like with your eagle eye you should be able to see the sparkly glowing stuff over here in this area to indicate that 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 is something over there let's go to this next marker which is the cardinal flower that spawns over here each and every day over here in this area that helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on and today is cycle five let's go i thought i had some i think i do i know there's something in the braithwaite manor home that i wanted to tell you guys about there's uh yeah that's about it there's a an antique alcohol bottle in the braithwaite manor's braithwaite manor home it's on the ground floor dinner table, which is about here inside the house. So when you do come in, go to the dinner table. There's a London dry gin antique alcohol bottle. Maybe you can look for that. I don't know. But I think this is our last marker. No, that that's not supposed to be there. That's, this is not a thing, I don't think. Not this cycle. The what when I was looking for is here. That was that's a co complete mistake. Um, right here inside of Rhodes, there's a couple things. There's about three three items for you guys. Two tarot cards and one um, family heirloom. This family heirloom here that's outside of this train station is a rosewood hairbrush. It's in the chest right at the this corner right here. There's a little treasure chest. Open up the treasure chest and you guys will get a rosewood hairbrush. Right uh over here at this saloon if you guys can see it to the left in the terrace area of this uh saloon that's the second floor go up the stairway and on the second floor back dining area you guys will get a knight of swords on one of the tables so go and grab that also over here there's another tarot card on a bench right in front of this barn there's a Four of Cups tarot card. Let's go up here to our next marker, which is our last marker. This marker is a random arrowhead. I cannot tell you guys what arrowhead it is. You do not need your metal detector for this one, but you do need your shovel because it's a dig spot. Come right here at this location and you will dig up a random arrowhead. There's also a random spot about right here. You do need your metal detector for this one. So come right here at this location with your metal detector and you will pull up a random item. I cannot tell you guys what category or, you know, what, you know, style of item you will get. But that's what that is right here at this location. If you do pull out your metal detector. Anywho, that's pretty much it for the extras. The cycles for today, once again, are family heirloom cycle six. <laughs> once again, to, for today, Sunday, August 1st. I like to say that so you guys know that it's the day. Family heirloom cycle six, all our jury cycle one, coin cycle six, arrowhead cycle one, wildflower cycle five, antique alcohol bottle cycle one, all tarot card cycle two, bird egg cycle six, and fossil cycle four. Remember to check the description box below just in case you guys cannot hear me or understand me. It, it will always be down there. If there are any mistakes, make sure you hit me up so I can fix it. Uh, if you guys see any mistakes in any of my videos, do not hesitate to fix to, to approach me or comment down in the comment section because I am not perfect. Um, anywho. Thank you guys for watching, looking, listening, liking, sharing, subscribing, commenting, and all the other good stuff. I do appreciate it so, so much. And if you haven't, if you don't, make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. It is your main man, Hitman, once again, and I'm out.